It's me, Mario! So this is Super Mario 64 as an FPS made by Mix Morris. This is a fan game. This isn't a mod or anything. So this is a fan game based off of Super Mario 64. Looks like this is based off of the DS version of the castle since the bridge is slanted and we have this area where the bunnies would be. Okay, yeah, we can shift to run. Okay, so that will be a, a good thing. Oh, we think we got a... A jetpack here. <laughs> That's pretty sick. Yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool fan game so far. See if there's anything up here. Oh no, it doesn't really look like it. See if there's anything up here. No, alright, it doesn't really look like it. I like how the sign like rotates to face you almost like it's like uh, NPC or something. What's the matter? You've never seen a talking sign before? Scram or that jumpsuit won't be the only red thing on you. Alright. Head to the castle here. Nice, like how they have the Mario head transitions and everything. And yeah, like, pretty good looking castle here and everything. Just all the models look really well so far. Well, this is the entire game with every level, so. Yo, this, yo, this goes. Alright, Pabon Battlefield. The Franzuka problem. Okay, nice. I like how all those blocks scatter. And Mix Morris has a great video about how he made this too. He has like this 20 minute video about uh, just the process of making this game. Welcome to Babon Battlefield. Watch out for bullets. These small boxes can be shot around with that pistol of yours. But you'll need something a little heavier to shatter it for coins. Alright, uh, I'm assuming we're gonna get- Oh wow, they actually take a couple shots. I'm probably going to be pressing shift almost the entire time. Will these explode in one shot? Okay, yeah. Good game design, because obviously they're an explosive, so it wouldn't take much to explode them. I don't know if uh, the stars kick us out. So, oh yeah, we have a star behind Chain Chomp's gate, too. Oh, is this bridge going to work as intended? Oh, I, I am fully impressed. <laughs> this is really, really cool so far. It doesn't take much, but... Yeah, we got blues and everything. Yeah, it's crazy how well this is working as an FPS so far. But what a concept. Taking Mario 64 and making it into an FPS. So there's one just right over there. Because yeah, right lately my go-to game has been Team Fortress 2, which is obviously like... Uh-oh. Alright, if I take another hit, I'll probably die. But it looks like... Uh, do we auto-hill? It looks like we are. Alright, yeah, it's kind of hard to avoid those. Maybe this guy, we talked to him, yeah. Hey, I noticed you on the way up here. Can't miss the bright red. Bomb man was pretty embarrassed and blasted him away with his Pranazuka. Anyways, I've got these spare landmines. It's a side hustle thing. Seeing lots of people want this guy gone, I decided to capitalize and start selling more landmines. Yes, sir. My special mushroom mines. If you want it, I'll sell three for the price of four. What a deal. That's only 25 coins. Ah, uh, sure. Got 26 coins. You required mushroom mines. 25 coins. Press Q to cycle through your inventory. Right, that's pretty cool. Have an inventory and everything. All right, <laughs> there, there he is. Mario, soon you'll be dead, yo. Listen, I've been working on my stand-up routine. Your opinion won't matter when you're in the ground. Prepare to die. Is that what generic bosses are saying nowadays? I think I'm doing damage to him. I'm just curious what this uh, this is gonna do. Oh, okay. I let down all three. Oh no! I need to get him to walk on the mines and then explode them. All right. I think I need to uh, buy some more landmines. Because, yeah, I don't think shooting him's really doing anything. Alright, let's let me buy some more. You've acquired mushroom mines. 25 points. Press Q to cycle through your inventory. Okay. Alright, let's try this again. Yeah, they're still there, since he's not moving. So if I go... Doesn't tell us how many. 
You beat me like an egg. Darn, the jokes still aren't connecting. Motherfly guy. Alright, sick. So, now we need to use these mushrooms. <laughs> You've acquired a power star. Alright, sick. Yeah, we have booted. One. Alright, Koopa the Quickscoper. <laughs> Pretty cool name, I like that. What's up, dude? What? You know my tag, probably. I got bound off Mushroom Kingdom Online for being toxic. I was the best quick scoper ever. If someone got in my way, I'd read their full name and addresses out loud. <laughs> yep, gets them every time. If your KD ratio is that low, you should shove your foot up your... Wait, you think you can beat me? Ha. Huh. First to the top of that mountain wins. See you up there, loser. <laughs> You're like the dialogue on this. Pretty clever. Alright, I gotta... Gotta keep running here. I think it's probably the best route. So we go here. And we cut through here. We're gonna beat Koopa the Quickscoper. <laughs> well, it looks like we came with ample time. Where did where did he go? There he is. Why is he just chilling there? Huff huff, I'm so tired. I don't get out enough. Listen, man, I can't finish. <laughs> My KD is still better than yours. Here, take the star. I'm gonna go to Pokey's Panzerotti's. I need grease and sugar. Alright, that makes sense. Have them tuckered out halfway through. Acquired a power star. Alright, island in the sky. I'll just go for reds, I guess. I kind of wish they had the number when you collect the reds, but at least they have the uh, right sound. Like, the pitch keeps going up after you collect every red, so you got that going for it, which is nice. Let's see what this one has to say. I'll open the jetpacks for you. Hold space to gain some serious height. What space? I've said too much. Oh, okay. Sick. So the cannons are open, but we already got those reds, so we might as well just, uh, just go for all the reds here. Oh, nice, you can have the switch here. That's pretty cool. How they're able to make most things work. Like, it's pretty impressive. Yeah, now we can fly over here. I think this is our last red. Hopefully it is. Please. Perfect. And it even shows up in the proper spot and everything. Hopefully this doesn't kill me. Actually, I'll take a jetpack just in case. I'd probably be fine, but I don't know if there's fall damage in this and I do not want to mess this up. Okay, yeah, it doesn't seem like there's fall damage. Seems like it just kind of bounces. <laughs> be insane if there was still wall jumps in here, but doing wall jumps in first person would probably be pretty weird. Alright, so now we got a couple of really easy stars here now. We got Island in the Sky we can do. Yeah, so now I think all the cannons should be open unless they close again, but yeah, they're, they're open. But I really like how all the stars are in this, their uh, proper locations. Very nice, another one. So what about Sky Secrets? This one, honestly, with the jetpacking ability, it should be really easy to get all those uh, coins in the sky. Yeah, but when it comes to FPSs, the only two FPSs I ever really got into was uh, like TF2 and then Halo. I was into like Halo 3, Halo Reach, and Halo 4 back in the day, but that's pretty much it, though. Alright, one, two, Oh wow. That was not fast enough. It like doesn't seem like we have enough time almost, but I'm sure that we do. Like that jetpack is not long. But I love how they're able to import like all these models and all these sound effects and everything. Just really makes it seem like you're playing that game. That one point in the sky. If 
Alright, sick. Up the six secrets. Well, yeah, um, the jetpack actually worked as a pretty good substitution for the wing cap, because having a wing cap in first person would have been just, just pretty strange. Wait, I think I'm missing a star somehow. Progress. Four or five. What? I just got that star. Star's here. And then when I collect it... Yeah, well, which star am I missing, then? It shows... Alright, so can confirm that uh, those two stars are tied to the same thing, so... I'm technically should have one more star than I do. And I watched a video by the legendary Waluigi Hacker, and when Waluigi Hacker was playing this, uh, he had the same thing happen to him, so... It's not my copy or anything, so... Yeah, so I did collect both stars. I thought I was going crazy there for a while, but, uh, it looks like star four is impossible to get, so. Blast away, chain chomps, bars. Okay, this one I'm going to backtrack to, because I'm pretty sure we'll need the grenade launcher, which, uh, we don't have yet. I, I just messaged Mix Morris and just told him about the bug, asked him if he knew about it, so I'll see his response. All right, next course, Womp's Fortress. This one is a classic. Alright, Gunsling, the Womp King. Here, hopefully we can yeah, do this shortcut here. I remember, I played through this map in Team Fortress 2 and it was pretty fun. There's a bunch of uh, Mario 64 maps in Team Fortress 2. Alright, let's see what he says. I am the Womp King, I will, I will crush you merciless. The only way you'd be able to stop me is perhaps ground pounding my back three times, but I won't let that happen. My AI won't let you. What's my AI? Uh, prepare to be crushed. Whether you prepare, are not, you will be crushed. Alright. <laughs> yeah, because we can actually ground pound. Oh no, he died. <laughs> Shoot. I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Ah, oh, wow. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Ow, watch the lower left crack in my back. My chiropractor says that's one of the biggest causes for my back pain. This won't be the last time I'll get my revenge jump, man. Alright, sick. So that one, you just kinda gotta know the trick. <laughs> Alright, get the star. You acquired a power star. Alright, to the top of the fortress. We know the shortcut here, so this shouldn't be too bad. I like how you just like take regular routes, like, knowledge of Super Mario 64 helps so much in this game. <laughs> they are very similar, like, this is legitimately just a game that was an FPS pretty much. Oh, this tower actually looks kind of difficult. Alright, sick. Wire to star. Shooting to the wild blue. Yeah, because there's going to be a star right in here. You can actually kind of see it. I don't know, I wasn't able to do it. Alright, this guy, maybe he'll sell us something good. Jetpack, you got it. I think I saw on the ledge over there. Okay, yeah. There's the jetpack. Alright, yeah, I'm going to need uh, some firepower for that. Oh yes, yeah, let's just get up here. Alright, red coins on top of the floating aisle. Alright. One. Two. Three. Four. Oh, 
five, six. No, jetpack's pretty powerful. All right, do we shoot this down like regularly? Oh yeah, we do. That's pretty cool. All right, it's sick. Stars down there and it's just weird how much this just feels like playing Mario 64, like how similar it is. Because a lot of the objectives are pretty much the same thing, except you're in first person, just remade. I love how we can just shoot that over and yeah, like pretty good physics and everything. There we go. Right in the cage. Alright, I'm pretty sure we need the grenade launcher for the other stars, so let's uh, head back to the castle. We'll backtrack once we have the grenade launcher. Alright, let's go Jolly Roger Bay. Okay, a water level. I really don't know how this is going to work. Let's see what this dote has to say. Hey, I'm Mario. I was just snorkeling in GR Bay to clear my mind. I was playing Mushroom Kingdom online earlier, but, but someone read out my full address and name after I killed them. It spooked me, so I bought a shotgun, huh? You got banned for toxicity, so I don't really need this anymore. You can have it. You want what do you say? 200 coins? Oh, right, you're a little short of money. Well, guess you should have went to call it. All right, so I need 200 coins. Let me go back and talk to him. Oh, yeah, the glass is gone here. All right, let's try it. Jolly Roger Bay. We got the Japanese painting or the painting in the DS one. Plunder under the sunken ship. It says. Hey, you want to learn how to swim? You can press that nifty control button of yours to sink. Similarly, the space button will help you rise. If you're fed up with swimming at the pace at a slow poke, you can hold shift. Also, watch out for the comms. They're real antsy today. Now, yeah, swimming isn't horrible, like... Alright, yeah, let's go in here. Yeah, nice, got the sub area and everything. Yeah, star's just up here, don't have to do that chest stuff. Nice! Another cool star. Honestly, this Jolly Roger Bay shouldn't be too bad. And the eel come out to play, like, I should be able to get these stars really fast. Especially because the swimming's, like, semi-fast at least. Like, we just have to shoot the eel. I think that's what we have to do. I think that's why he's moving. There we go. Sick. A mine cavern. Oh, yeah. One that's over there. I kind of wish this was uh, non stops and he didn't get booted out or he got the choice, but I guess it makes it a little bit more like the original game. And I mean, the controls are pretty fast, so it's pretty easy to get anywhere in the level. Just explaining this, I'm pretty much at my destination already. Watch out for the mines. They're pretending to be rocks. Unbelievable. Someone needs to speak with their manager. Oh, okay. There's mines. I'll just wait so I don't die here. Very right, nice. We don't have to deal with the chests at all. I should have caught, like, a little bit more coins, actually. I'm gonna go for it, just because... Ah, oh, no, this won't be enough for the 200. Ah, oh, one off. <laughs> Come on. Alright, red coins on the ship afloat. Alright, this one. Another one that it won't be too bad at all. Wait, I forgot that there's red coins in this seat, too. It's kind of frustrating. It's like, just choose one location and put the coins. Okay, I'm gonna try for hundreds here. I do not know if hundreds are an actual thing. I had 200 before, so I'm gonna get up to... 300 and just see if I'll get a hundred coin star for that because it shows that there's seven stars in each level so Maybe they're still doing hundreds
Seems like this level has a lot of coins too, so honestly shouldn't be too bad. I enjoy the overcast weather. Oh yeah, let me open up the jetpack for you. Okay, perfect. Uh, I might have to jetpack over to this one actually. Okay, oh well, that'll work. Oh yeah, like this is really well done. It'd be really cool if you were to, uh, if Mix Morris were to do this with other games too, like, uh, Banjo Kazooie or like Conker's Bad Fur Day, you know? So, definitely show Mix Morris some love. Like, check out his channel. Like, his video about how he made this game is real. It's a really good video too with really good editing. Highly recommend his channel. And I mean, it would just be sick if, uh, he did this with other games. Like, I think I know where the last one is. Should be in one of these clams. Yeah, there it is. Just chilling in the clam kit. Wait, what? I'm still missing some, but we'll see. We're going for hundreds here anyway, so we got some exploring to do. I think I got them all. Nice, yeah, I'm really close. Nice, okay, there is a hundred coin star in each level. That is really good to know. And the hundred coin star kicks you out. Okay. Alright, well, at least we figured that out. Sure. We got a shotgun. Alright, I, I think this is a little bit better. Probably won't really have to go back to that other gun unless we have to like repetitively shoot something, but... Right, sick. And I'm assuming he was able just to take MP3s for this music, but... Nice that it's like the music spot on too. Bit pack to the pillars and into the abyss. Oh yeah, this one is pretty easy. So into the abyss is usually through the jet stream, but we'll see how that works. That one was super fast, just in and out. Oh yeah, this is right where through the jet stream is. So yeah, not difficult at all. All right, sick. That's hundred percent for this level. All right, let's check out CCM. We got slip sliding away. All right, now he's got the slide. How's this gonna work? Oh no, uh, yeah, it's funny to get it done fast. Hey, there we go. Fire to power star. Able to do the shortcut and everything. Little penguin lost. I wonder if this one's gonna be the same. Penguin. Oh wow, we're gonna have to shoot it all the way down. This is gruesome. I like how it's just falling so slowly, which will be nice. It'll make it easier to get it over there. I like how it just falls so slow. <laughs> like anti-gravity, which is nice. It makes it easier, so... There you go, there's your penguin back. Oh, I found my daughter. Well, I suppose you could have this star. 
but please be on the lookout for that mint condition PSA 10 holographic Charizard. Very cool. It's a cool way to recreate that star. Hole in the wall. Hole in the wall. Are they talking about wall kicks will work? Alright, come on. Okay, sick. Actually, this is probably hole in the wall, maybe. I don't know. This are, this would have been Snowman's big head. Finding secret spots. Three. Four. And then the fifth one's over here. It's really cool. I like the snow particles and everything. Like, there, there is a lot of really impressive stuff in this. Be fair to the game. Very nice. Another star. Alright, frosty slide for eight reds. Yeah, there should be a red over here. Yeah. If someone plays this and they're not familiar with Mario 64, it'd be so much harder because they had to like collect the reds or hundreds and, and everything. Actually, is there a red right here? One here. Another one over here. Is this the last one? There's probably one more. Come on, okay, leap of fate. I'll open the jetpack as long as you get off my island. Yeah, that's good. Don't even know. Like, usually there's a red up there. I do not know which one I'm missing. So I'm pretty sure that this is just missing two red coins. So that star is not obtainable also. Yeah, let's go for hundreds here, I guess. But yeah, the hundreds is going to be kind of a pain since it kicks you out of the level for getting it. So I don't know. We can get her done, though. I'm not sure how many coins I had to start to, so... Yeah, there's a blue coin switch over there, which definitely helped for our 100 coin journey. I think I like this gun better, because you can just constantly shoot, and the shotgun you need to reload and everything, so... Hopefully we'll be good for hundreds here right away. And, alright, these... I like how they have blues just around the course. It's a nice addition here. Wait. Um, I think it just happened to be hundreds, yeah. Okay, I think we just need star three and star six. Yeah, I don't know how to get star three. Yeah, I could start four of the red coins. It doesn't look like we can get them in this mission. Yeah, if we talk to the penguin here, the penguin says, Welcome to the slippery slide. I think I secretly saw something in that wide, wacky wall. Maybe if you check there, there will be a shiny, shivering star. Go through there, yeah, because this was the one that kind of failed earlier because I didn't make the jump properly. Here we go, down here. Cool, cool Mountain's good. I don't think any of the special courses are implemented, but we'll check. Let's check out the secret slide here. Now I'll go back to Womps and uh, move on battle for once. I'm pretty sure there's a gun in here that you can use. Okay, yeah, those courses aren't implemented, so. Alright, that's fair. Alright, let's go. go to Bowser. 
Bowser number one. Oh, I like the updated picture. Yeah, that's just transparent. Alright, we got... Seems just as annoying as in the original. Alright, yeah. Run over here like normal. But yeah, very faithful to the original game. Oh, yeah. Got burned, but it's all good. Yeah, it's so weird just, just going around this in the first person environment. Yeah, I definitely prefer the other gun, because it just takes like three shots of having to wait for that like long reload animation. Yeah, that's definitely the way to do it. Hopefully these guys aren't one hit kills. Oh no. Alright, I think I'm okay. Yeah, just crazy to think that like, I don't know, these things like these moving stuff, like these would have been created almost from the ground up, so. But no, like, surprised how adjusted I am to platforming in a first person shooter though. <laughs> Should be one more up there. Yeah, I definitely prefer this to the shotgun. The shotgun, I don't know, it's just frustrating when you have to reload. It might be faster, but I'd rather just be able to constantly shoot than having to wait a couple seconds between each shot. Okay, that's weird. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, let's try this, I guess. Oh wait, that, that actually worked, all right. There's some weird physics there. I'm still missing a red. I think I am at least. All right, where would it, where could it be? Maybe just the animation didn't play, I don't know. Where is the red? I'm pretty sure I got them all and the game's just wasn't programmed to give out this star for some reason. <laughs> okay, that's sick. How did you get past my Goombas? Someone's getting demoted. Oh, Cookie likes scrambled eggs. And they hate scrambled eggs. Prepare to be fried. Alright. Let's see which... What's gonna be easier? Uh, actually, maybe shotgun. Dude, what's getting me? Oh, okay. Maybe get more in the center. Yeah, he has a lot of health here. I like how they use the Giga Bowser model. Oh, okay, come on. Oh, this isn't good. It's kind of tricky. Oh, he's getting so close. Right, let's go the outer edges here. So much health. I think this might be a better option here. Oh, okay, I almost walked off the edge there. I was way too close. Uh, I am so close. I can't believe how long this boss fight's taken. Yeah, the health bar. I must be just covering up a little bit of the health bar there. Gotta be kidding me. No, no. Should be dead. <laughs> there we go. You think you've destroyed me once and for all? You've only destroyed me once, not the for all part. <laughs> once I'm reincarnated, I will be back stronger than ever. Okay, sick. Alright, 
finally. Castle Courtyard? Oh, we got EGOT here. Mario, you're here. If I sold you my latest invention, would you go in there and get rid of the, all those ghosts? Standard coins? Alright. You've acquired the Poltergeist 3000, 300 coins. Press Q to cycle through your inventory. Alright, cool. Got a way to get ghosts now. Alright, go on a ghost hunt. Alright, come on, first mission here. Like how they kind of got a remix to this uh, theme. Right now, over here. I found it for a while. The bridge is gone for some reason, so. Come from the other way. I like how you can see uh, the top of the floor, how it uh, rotates there. <laughs> Probably be the stairs, yeah. Alright. Ghosts over here. That's weird that there's those bookshelves there. Alright, sick, got all the ghosts. Nice easy first star. Ride King Boo's merry-go-round. Alright. This one should be pretty straightforward. We'll just head over here. <laughs> Go to the merry-go-round and we should be set. A lot of booze. I wonder if there's even going to be big booze here. Yeah, it's thick. Another quick star. Blast the bookshelf. Okay. Um, I don't have the grenade launcher yet, so I don't know how I'm going to be able to do that. up here. Yeah, I, I doubt we have to run around. We probably have to... Okay, there we go. And that big boost haunted. It's been a pretty easy level so far. All the stars have been pretty fast. I'm assuming we probably just have to get up here. Oh yeah, there's King Boo. How many hits is it gonna take? Yeah, it's sick. Alright, seek the eight red coins. Try again. Four, and then the other four should be upstairs. I got you can have like multiple doors just open at once compared to Mario 64. Leave all the doors open. Should just be one last one in here. Yeah. Okay, nice. Oh, this thing doesn't even tilt, it looks like. Okay. <laughs> Alright, acquired a power star. Sick. Let's get the hundreds out of the way here. I, I should have remembered what I had. This 100 point star might be buggy. Oh, 
Oh wait, please. I, I'm pretty sure I've gotten over 100 coins. But I just do not think it's gonna give me the star. Oh, sick! We got a sniper rifle! <laughs> cool. Oh, okay, here we go. We got a... I am the big Pianta. I don't know how I got through this tiny door. I just woke up here. <laughs> it is peaceful. I like to meditate, and the salad sounds really nice right about now. What's this? Oh, it's my rocket launcher. I'm a big guy, I need a big gun, but after finding my inner peace, I no longer want it. Here, you can take it for 200 coins. Yeah, I'll buy it. I've acquired rocket launcher, 200 coins. Press Q to cycle through your inventory. Let's go to lethal lava land. I think this level's gonna be just incredibly easy. Bullies barrage the star. Too bad there isn't like a Koopa shell or anything, but. I gotta have that sound effect and everything. Come on! Alright, I should've saw that coming. <laughs> you can actually stay in the lava for like a while. Take this route. Obviously, the eight red coins are going to be easy in this one. The bullies? Maybe I need the grenade launcher. They seem to be almost indestructible. Sweet, first star. Yeah, it is kind of a pain getting on this platform just because you can't really do anything to the bullies, they're just indestructible. Alright, come on, this is. Kind of there, they're just... Okay, I'm so close. At least they're not doing damage. There we go. <laughs> those are really weirdly programmed, those bullies. A coin puzzle. Wait, something's missing. Alright, this one should be pretty easy. Oh, okay, one red's missing. Don't want to make it that easy. Oh, okay, it's over here. Oh, yeah, that's not bad. Oh, these bullies are so annoying because there's nothing you can really do. Alright, let's wait for health to get back here. Here we go. Okay, nice, another star. Red hot rolling log. Okay, so over here. I wonder if this log is even gonna roll properly. Oh, it does. Kinda like the physics aren't exactly the same. I'm still impressed though. All right, just the two uh, volcano stars here. That level's has been pretty good.
Okay, sick. Please give me enough time. Okay, there we go. <laughs> nice. And now just for the hundreds. I just do not want to deal with these bullies. Okay, sick. That should be 100 coin star here. Alright, cool. So that level is done. Alright, so Hazy Maze Cave. I mean, Beast in the Cavern. This area looks really different. I think it's because they're using the DS models. Uh, I'm just not really used to the DS models. Okay, see what this says. Those are skilled enough can jump this treacherous path. If not, be gone to the right path. Alright, yeah, that honestly isn't that bad. Alright, let's see if Dory's over here. Oh yeah, we do have Dory, but this platform's lowered a little bit. Pretty cool. Alright, nice. Got the star. Good pack for eight red coins. Yeah, so we'll just head over here. Usually this would be conveyor belt for eight reds, but... Yeah, we'll use this jet pack. Honestly, jetpacking probably won't take that long to get them all. But yeah, I like the rocket launcher the best. It's definitely like most powerful and take out most enemies with just one hit. Alright, get the jetpack again. I missed that one. Uh, I really do not know where the last reds are. I wish there was a counter for reds because you really don't really know how many you have at any time.
Okay, yeah, that looks like that's probably the last one. But it please be last. Yeah, and we're good. Okay, where's that star? It's like shown to be in like a black area. Yeah, I guess the star spawns out of bounds. So I guess uh, we can go for hundreds this time, I guess. Make the best case scenario, because yeah, this game has a lot of uh, bugs and unobtainable stars. Hey, I got these coins over here. Uh, I just, I didn't pay attention to how much I had because I thought I was going for red. But then the red star spawned out of bounds, and if I... It doesn't show me how many coins I collect, but if I collect over 100, it's not going to count. Right, what's in here now? Because usually it'd be metal cap, but... Oh, wow. Happy mask salesman over here, <laughs> what? That's creepy. You met with a terrible fate. Oh, that's pretty cool, but... I don't think we can get out of here. I think this is more just an easter egg. Alright. So yeah, we really didn't get much accomplished because... Of all the bugs in this, like honestly, it's like, oh no, you can't get the eight red coin stars, so and I gotta go for hundreds, but hundreds doesn't work if you go over hundred coins. You have to get right on hundred coins with a yellow. But you didn't keep track of how much you had initially because you thought you're going for reds, which didn't work, so. Okay, so we're at 647. I'm gonna get hundreds out of the way here. 757 is the magic number. Yeah, break all those. Yeah, a bunch of coins down here now. Yeah, like all the particle effects about I like all the blocks break like this. Alright, 701. I think it was 47, right? Yeah, okay, there we go. Got hundreds out of the way. Oh yeah, I guess, uh, over here's the start of the maze. Yeah. Head in here. Gotta look for that door. Here it is. Now yeah, that should take us up to the jetpack. We can collect that star over the other there. But, gotta say, like, really? I'm just getting used to playing the game like this. I was actually just streaming Mario 64 Chaos Edition yesterday, so it's like every time I've been playing Mario 64, it's been just like in such like a weird way. <laughs> Navigating the toxic maze. Yeah, this should be the door that I'm looking for. Oh yeah, this is a different entrance way. Alright, rise up. Oh no, no, I fell. Hopefully he comes back down. I just messed that up. Whatever, I'll get I'll watch for rolling rock. 
Okay, please. I'm not sure if that's the intended way, but yeah, that's one way of getting it. Yeah, I used to actually, uh... I was streaming Mario Chaos Edition yesterday. I used to stream on Twitch all the time before I started doing YouTube, and... I know I enjoyed streaming on Twitch. I think it definitely helped me become a better YouTuber when I started playing videos and commentating over it, so... I'm glad I had my Twitch experience from, like, back in the day. That was probably back in, like, 2015, though, when I was younger. When I was doing Twitch. Well, I don't think I'd ever go back to Twitch. I just prefer YouTube streaming. Take this up. Alright, sweet. You acquired a power star. Alright, now pretty much just, uh... Amazing emergency exit. That should be pretty easy to get. No, I'm so not used to the DS uh, textures and levels. <laughs> but the DS uh, remake was actually pretty good overall. Like, I know for for the hardware that they had, they made a really good remake with adding all the characters and everything. It just sucks that they didn't have an analog stick and... Uh, I really wish when the 3DS came out they would have patched so you could have used the um, uh, circle stick properly, but they didn't patch the game so the circle stick was just nine directions. No, I, I jumped. Okay. Perfect, yes, 39 stars. Right now, just uh, shifting sand land, then we can do a Dardar -dar Dock. Wait, I wonder how many stars we need. Probably 30, like regularly. Yeah. Yeah, still have shifting sand land to do. I wonder, I wonder if they're going to implement that boss fight that's in there. That'll be interesting. Alright, so we got. 1v1 with Klepto. Oh, yeah. This one will actually be pretty fun. We'll probably have to shoot the bird instead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cool. That's one of the cooler stars. Alright, sick. Got another one. Shining the top of the pyramid. Oh wow, these are some really easy stars here. Especially because we can just walk on like any slants, so. Wonder if we can blow off the top. No. Alright, yeah, we'll just climb this. This will probably actually take a little while to climb, but it shouldn't be too, too bad. Yeah, then this should. Got some blocks to climb up. It's sick. Oh, I like how- I like that they have the run button and you can run fairly fast. Like, if, if Mario couldn't run this fast, this game would be so much more of a pain, but... I do not know why I'm taking damage. Okay, here we go. Okay, please, alright, to the top. No, 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 no! You gotta be kidding me. Okay, sick. Got that star. Okay, and the next one is jetpack atop the four pillars. Okay. I wonder if that's gonna make the pyramid open or anything crazy like that. Probably not, but I guess we'll see. One. Two. Probably gonna run out. And 
three. Four. Oh, yeah, wow. Wow, the pyramid actually moves up and spins and everything. That, that's pretty cool. Honestly, was not really expecting that, so definitely a pretty cool addition. Alright, so yeah, that takes us here. Which is probably the ideal way to uh, get to the top of the pyramid, too, to be honest. And looks like we're gonna have this boss fight here. I don't know. All right, we got a star there at least. Free flying for eight red coins. Yeah, they're in kind of bad spots, but it shouldn't be too bad. Two, three. Oh, they have the chain chomp here as the tox boxes. Oh, there's a lot of blues here. Four. Okay, five. Six. Oh yeah, there's one at the start here that's, uh, oh, yeah, I was forget about that one. Alright, seven. Alright, eight. And we're set. Wow, okay. Perfect. Right, secret pyramid puzzle. I honestly think uh, getting on top of the four uh, for these is probably the easiest way. Oh right, yeah, we'll just use the jetpack. Let's go in and we'll do the five secrets. One. Two. Three, four, and five. Okay, perfect. Okay, so we have 972, okay, 1079 is what we need. Those just <laughs> went all over the place. Be helpful. Alright. Oh yeah, there's a blue coin switch in there, so... And we're already in pretty close. Probably won't even need to go inside the pyramid. <laughs>
Okay. For some reason. Oh, okay. Here we go, 100 coin star. Hey, sick, that level's all done. Right now it's Dire Dire Docks and the first, second Bowser stage. <laughs> I like how, I like the picture, how it's just kind of stationary. Alright, bow board Bowser sub. Oh yeah, they have this ledge here in the DS version. Oh wow. The really easy one. It looks like there's two really easy ones. Board Bowser sub. Yeah, this level seems a lot smaller than usual, I think. They must have did the scaling a little bit different, which I like to make it a little bit smaller so it's not as uh, long to traverse. Especially this tunnel. This tunnel, there's really no need for it. It's just wait time, you know? Yeah, there we go. There's the star. Sushi star. Okay, Jetpacking for eight red coins. Okay, is this different? 148. 149, yeah. I'll do uh, the chest currents really quick too. Might as well just get the easy ones over with. Oh yeah, probably five secrets instead. Alright, nice. Another like pretty easy star. Alright, let's nice we got the jetpack here. Works pretty well. Yeah, Dire Dire Docks only has four red coins. That's uh, part of one of the glitches in this game. These. I really don't know how much we started with because I didn't keep track. I thought we were going to go for the reds. Pretty sure we already passed 100, but if a blue puts us over, then it doesn't count. Alright, these. Okay, nice. Able to get that hundred coin star. Um, nautical secret. So this one, I think this one should be uh, just the one over here in that cage. We'll probably have to maybe blast it open with this rocket launcher. Oh, nice! The heck, <laughs> that's pretty cool. All right, now let's head to Bowser 2. Apparently none of the Bowser courses spawn the red coin star, so... I'm gonna try to get all eight, but like, it shouldn't actually do anything. For this. So weird. I'm just so used to playing Mario 64 as a first person shooter. It's definitely kind of strange. Alright, yeah. He's jetpack. We have this red, that's always annoying. 
Okay, luckily I collected that. Oh, this Bowser fight's probably gonna be pretty difficult. Well, we have the rocket launcher this time at least, so it might actually be easier than Bowser 1 was. Oh wow, these actually uh, moved the same way. That's pretty cool, actually. No, okay, why am I stuck here? Why am I stuck here? Like, I'm legitimately- okay, there we go, I'm stuck. Pretty sure that was the last red. It's just yeah, red coins don't spawn in Bowser levels. Oh well, he found me again in my fire sea. Being incarnated by my infamous magic Koopa Kami. Oh wow. Yeah, I guess rocket launcher is probably my best bet. Taking away like a little sliver every time. This is probably going to be faster than Bowser 1 since we have this rocket launcher. There we go. No! You've destroyed me in my fire sea. Kamek still has enough power to reincarnate me. This isn't over. Alright, nice. Alright. Get to the second floor. You found an M60. Cycle through your inventory with Q. What's sweet? Yeah, let's just go straight to what Dry World. The odd secret. Well, we have a Mega Mushroom here. Oh, nice! I like how they uh, have that up there, so we can get up. That's actually pretty cool. No, it's pretty easy to get stuck in those uh, fences over there. Yeah, they have to really kind of edit this level to make it possible to do a lot of the things. I wonder what that Chuck here does. Alright, sick, here we go. Acquired a power star. Is this guy gonna send me flying up in the air? No, he just damages me. I'll do the five secrets. Do. Yeah, let's see what this says. There must be a secret around here. Which means it's behind me. Oh, yeah, this one has a warp over here, yeah. It looks like here's where cannon would be. Okay, so I'll make for an easy star. Alright, sweet. Let's hit the five secrets really quick here. A three. I usually have to move a block. Yeah, so just have to get up here. And then, 
five. All right, sweet. But where did that spawn? Like, that spawn out of bounds? So it seems like it spawns out of bounds. Oh, yes, that's how we get over here. Okay. I really don't know what these mushrooms do. Oh, yeah, they just make us jump up really high. Got redads and everything in here. It makes sense that they did. Ocarina of Time, this place has always had a bit of an Ocarina of Time vibe to it. Okay, so we can just get these reds. Two. Oh wow, I don't even think those are enemies. Oh, Majora's Mask music. Is this not going to time too? I honestly forget. I think of this uh, more Majora's Mask when I hear it than not going to time, but I think it's in both games. Well, this is Song of Healing, so yeah, this should only be Majora's Mask. And then, I think that's our last one, hopefully. I think I gave away the last secret too easily. Well, I won't this time. There's not a secret warp behind me. Ha, try finding it now. <laughs> yeah, right over there. Right over here. Okay, sweet. And it spawned in a good spot this time, which is nice. Alright, secret in the shallows and the skies. Alright, this will be easy. Switch up on the Mega Mushroom. I really don't know how even like... Oh, I bet you uh, that switch probably makes blocks over there. Okay. Well, where's the star? Oh, okay, wait. I'm really close to it, yeah. There's like just behind me. I think it'll warp us behind the cage, yep. Yeah. And we're set. Yeah, let's get up to 1380 coins. Thirteen eighty. Honestly, should be too bad. There's tons of blues around. All right, see where these spawn. Okay, sweet. Already getting close. I we can just shoot those spots too, which is kind of nice. Oh no. No, don't make me die in this cutscene. These. Not too bad of that. There isn't just a jetpack in here. 13. Yeah, getting close.
Get all these. Yeah, I'm pretty close to the 1380. Right, sweet. <clears throat> that should be it for uh, what dry world here. Now, Snowman's Land. Well, we just walk right through here. It's empty. It's quiet. But still, you feel like you are being watched. You aren't alone. For such a bright room, it's enshrouded with darkness. Ah, that's kind of creepy. Alright, Snowman's big head. Nice, you can just walk up here, take like a rank shortcut, which is nice. Oh, come on. Why? Okay, am I supposed to get up there? Oh, I probably need the jetpack or something. Okay, can I go into this? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I can just blast that. Show with the bullies. Alright, sweet. It's a nice easy star. Blast the cage away. Tick. <laughs> In like a star every 20 seconds. And the freezing pond. Yeah, this one just becomes really easy. So yeah, we can't get one of those coins last, even though usually it would be with the last coin that you'd obtain. Yeah, I just love how we can walk up any slopes. That's definitely a quality of life change. Oh, well, the number's actually on the screen right now. <laughs> Alright, sweet. Red coin star is there. I wish the 100 coin star didn't kick you out too. It would make uh, collecting the stars a little bit easier. Alright, cool. Into the igloo. I think we pretty much got all the stars except hundreds and the one at, that's at the top there, which I don't really know how we're supposed to get. Oh no, no, no. Okay, how do we collect that? Like, honestly. Alright, I'll just go for hundreds here. Shoot, I don't know how many I had at the start, though. Yeah, I think uh, there's no way to make it up there. Yeah, like, this level seems like it has a bunch of coins in it, though, so... That'd be too bad. are a lot of coins. <laughs> I 
Yeah. Head into the igloo again. Wait, oh, can we go out of the igloo? Well, we should be able to. Yeah, there's the door. Oh yeah, this is good water anyway, so... Right, sick. It's pretty quick to get that one. Alright, that's good for that level. Now just, uh... Fall Tall Mountain. Um, scale the mountain. Can we... Use this trick to get up. Okay, yes we can. That's gonna make scaling, like honestly, pretty easy because we're already like over halfway up. This is, yeah, there's multiple stars that just are pretty much all scale the mountain. All you really have to do for some of them. Oh no, did not make that jump, no! Alright, wow, I was just able to make that jump. That's gonna be tricky. Oh. Let's see what the monkey has to say. Make sure to love your pets, they have emotions too. Okay, yeah, then you just spawn a star down there. Very nice. Good, there's star there, but yeah, we'll get this monkey one. Yeah, uh, pretty easy to catch that monkey. Like monkey, usually it's pretty difficult, but. All right, sick. Got another star. So, one. Two, three, four, and then there should be four in this area also. We got one. I think I might know where the last one's gonna be. I have a decent idea for it. I think I gotta go like way up. Kinda like over here. Oh yeah. There we go. Oh no. Uh, okay, yeah, that's it. Okay, sick. Alright, the slide star. So, uh, the slide seems like it's still gonna be here. Alright, nice. That jumps on, so not too bad once you know what you're doing. Yeah, we have this slide star here. It's <laughs> cool. We actually got the slide physics out pretty decent in this game. These coins. Alright, sweet, just at the end here. Breathtaking view from the bridge. Okay, yeah, that one. Another one that's gonna be pretty easy. 
Oh yeah, this is the DS model, so this starts a lot easier than it is in the 64 version. Which I really do not know how it's gonna work. I'm pretty sure there's a warp around. Oh yeah, they have these blocks here to make it a little bit easier to get over here. Okay, well... Um... Maybe I have to talk to the bomb. I really don't know. Wait, 1731. Who is what we have, so we need 1830. 1831. Or 1830, I guess. Yeah, I'll keep that in mind. 1830. This. No, no. Let me get away. All right. Those chuckies are scary. See if we can talk to this bomb here. I lurk in the shadows, and what they fear, I am justice. I'll open the jetpacks for you. Okay. Hopefully that worked, but I'm gonna go for uh, this star anyways. Oh well, just fell down. Oh well. <laughs> 50 more coins. Here. Yeah, I just need 20 more. I'll have to avoid the blues because they might take me over. Here we go. This should be it. Okay, perfect. That should be it for this level. The bomb didn't actually open the cannons there, so the star on the lonely shroom is impossible. Right now for Tiny Huge Island. How about the piranhas? All right. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> all right. I guess I didn't really have to get them all, but all right, pretty cool star here. All right. Rematch with Koopa the Quick Scoper. Alright, let's see Koopa the Quick Scoper. Hey man, oh wait, the Red Plumber. The man who completely and utterly 360'd me last time. I've been working on my horizontal, it's like vertical leap, but for horizontal scope. What do you say, another race? I'm so banned from MKO and I don't have anything to do. Oh, it's on. And you want to barter for this here, Star? Well, I know he didn't really say that or anything really since we started talking, but I'll wager it to motivate myself. Three, two, one, go. Cool that, like, I don't know. He was walking so slow though. It's pretty funny.
Oh, I wonder if he's actually going to make it to the finish line this time. No, it looks like he stopped over there once again. Huff, huff, not again. Puff, listen, man, just take the star. Five itty bitty secret. One. Two. Three, four, five. <laughs> yeah, it's really fast. Okay, sweet. Hey, tip top of the huge island. That should be pretty easy. Just have to make it up there. Yeah, should just be hopefully just right around the corner here. Oh yeah, yeah. Seven. Oh no. Uh. All right, whatever. I'll just get that one instead. Alright, try this again. Um, I won't use the jetpack too aggressively or else I'm going to clip back up again. Alright. Alright, sweet. Alright. 1993. 1993. No, pretty cool level, like Got the size mechanics pretty spot on still, which is pretty good. There we go, perfect. Alright, and Tiny Huge Island is done. I know, let's head to the up upstairs. Apparently TikTok clock is one of the glitchiest levels in the game. Yeah, it seems like TTC, you, we should probably won't be able to collect a single star and... Alright, I guess only some of these blocks are moving. So... One, two... Three... Wow, this, yeah, this is actually moving. Three, four. Oh, 
five, six. Seven, eight. Fours, yeah, star doesn't spawn. There we go, 77. Yeah, that's why so so these stars just lock up the game. Alright, yeah, so TikTok clock is just, uh, can't really do anything in there, it looks like. It seems like every star is just gonna lock up the game, so... Let's go Rainbow Ride. Alright. Bruiser crossing the rainbow. Alright, now you can easily just head over here. It's cool how they made like these tricky triangles up here. Alright, sick. Right, big house in the sky. that to get over here. <laughs> right, nice. Another star. There, we can go for the reds over here, I guess. It's, actually, I think we can just walk on the path, which will be nice. I think that's the way they did it. Yeah, okay, thank god. We don't have to take the, uh... I know, taking the carpet might be the worst thing in the original Super Mario 64. Oh, come on. Alright, come on. Like, why does the game have to do this? Okay, let's try this path. Legit two stars left, and I don't really know how I'm gonna get them. Because there's one there and one there. But yeah, I have no idea how we're supposed to get up there. Maybe we can use the jetpack. We should be able to make it up there. Like Here, I'm gonna go back up. I'm just gonna. It's apparently, uh. Somewhere over the rainbow and the red coin stars are tied to the same star, so we really just gotta get on the ship somehow. Hmm, I wonder... I'm gonna go back to Bobon Battlefield and just kinda get the rest of the stars that I can here. So yeah, so I have the 100 coin star, plus I have the one for blowing up that area. There we go. It's 
So two three one fives that we're gonna need. get a hundred that'll be pretty good and then we'll be up to yeah 83 stars pretty much over halfway there <laughs> Getting really close now. Tribute for Urp upon Battlefield. I can go buy buy some landmines though. All right. Now oh, it's eggs to castle. Which stars do we have left? Okay, so we're on Battlefield's good. Womps. We have two stars left. So for Womps we have star 6 and 100 coins. Yeah, we have 1000, so we just need 1100. Yeah, blast away the wall. We'll go for 100 coins first. These blues give us a fair bit. Oh wow. <laughs> Completely blow them up. Blast away the wall. Oh, yeah, there it is. <laughs> Very cool that we just actually like blasted away the wall like that. Okay, six. That's good for Womps. Oh, cool, cool mountain. That star you can't get. Big Boo's Haunt. Two stars left, hundreds, and star three. We got blast the bookshelf. Okay, and then hundred coins. So we got one one five. Go for hundred coins first. Oh nice, we can blast the piano. Oh, 
the, the blue coin switch over here, which is something going to help. Sick. All right, let's go for hundreds here. It's one, three, two, something. actually a lot of blues there. knock it up there. That's all the stars I can get. That's pretty much 100% completion. For what we can do, at least. Let's head to the final Bowser here. Alright. Endless stairs, which aren't endless. Oh yeah, let's face this final Bowser. Go through stage here, but yeah, this red coin star won't spawn. Sweet. Coins, yeah. Use the jetpack to get up here. Alright, sweet. Usually there's a red over here. Oh yeah, there it is. Chuck, yeah. Okay, sweet. Walk up here. Alright, save, save those flames. This blue. Yeah, I guess we just have to literally stand on this now. back up we have to like be this weird like kind of side jump but yeah red coin stars don't spawn in bowser levels for some reason 
This is where you die. Scrammy, worthless bummer. I will bury you and then dig you up again just to bury you again. Because I'm going to enjoy burying. Don't let me move. No, 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 no. Do not let it end like this. No. No, no. Yes. No, you've killed me once and for all. Why am I monologuing for you? This won't be the last of me. Just wait for the next FPS port. Wait. What's an FPS port? Alright, cool. Mario Mario, this is Toad. My god. You've done it. You've saved the princess. You've saved us all. Alright, cool. Thank you so much for to playing my game. Game creator, Mix Morris. Huge shoutouts to Mix Morris for making this. This is a really cool fan game here. Had a lot of fun with it. It'd be really cool if I got an update to fix uh, a lot of the glitches. Subscribe to Mix Morris on YouTube for more Unity creations and stuff. Yeah. Many thanks and credits to Nintendo and other artists for assets such as 3D models and music. Obviously, huge shoutouts to Mix Morris for making this, and thank you guys for checking out this video. If you could leave a like or maybe consider subscribing to the channel, I would greatly appreciate it, and I hope that you all have a great day.